Hey Devil Lawrence County, thanks for 25 great years here at Mellonmore. Packing and shipping of course is what we do, but if you need that passport photo, we're here for that too. We're here Monday through Friday, 9.30 to 5.30. We're here to help you here at St. Patrick's or any time during the year. Look forward to seeing you here. Come see your friends here at Mellonmore. And on behalf of everybody here at Mellonmore, thanks for 25 great years. We look forward to seeing you soon. Parts of this program are brought to you by Matt Hatchett, your Georgia General Assembly representative in District 155. Matt is proud to be a part of the St. Patrick's Festival and would like to encourage you to bring your family out and support all these events at our 58th annual St. Patrick's Festival. Erin Gobra. Hi, this is Meg Greer Evans with Middle Georgia Estate Planning. I wanted to let everybody know that Warren Greer Law is now Middle Georgia Estate Planning. We wanted to let our clients know exactly what specialized services we can offer. We can help you with the preparation of a will or a trust, power of attorney, or health care directive. We also specialize in elder law and can assist you with guardianships and conservatorships, as well as the issues facing elderly as they go into long-term care, such as Medicaid planning or VA aid and attendance planning. If you have any questions or would like to learn more, give us a call at 478-272-2885. Hi, I'm Perry Williamson, and we've been baking here at Williamson's Bakery since 1927. In 1965, my grandfather, Merle Williamson, hung our name on this bakery. Ever since then, people have been stopping in for the Williamson's tradition. We invite you to do the same here at 1634 Veterans Boulevard, or catch us on Facebook, or just come get you some. Dublin's newest and most modern hotel is the Hampton Inn and Suites. Relax and enjoy your stay while near the best in dining, golf courses, and business centers. Start your day with a free hot breakfast. Enjoy our pool, indoor fitness center, and Wi-Fi. Plan your next family reunion, meeting, training session, or social gathering at Hampton Inn and Suites, 103 Travel Center, located by Longhorn and Cracker Barrel. Hampton Inn and Suites by Hilton. Med First is committed to service and quality care. Located on Hillcrest Parkway near Fairview Park Hospital, we're built on the philosophy of continually providing new and effective services to meet the health care needs of the communities we serve. We have a complete inventory of all the latest in-home medical equipment and appliances. Also, the latest technology in seat lift chairs is displayed in one of the largest medical showrooms anywhere. MedFirst has become a leader in sleep therapy in the middle Georgia area as well as home respiratory services. We have staff on call to help you at any time, so call us day or night, 478-274-1900 or come by and see us at 1204 Hillcrest Parkway. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, big part of Super Saturday. It's the first annual, am I right about that? First, yep. We're here at the Cornhole Tournament and we've got Miss Marla and Miss Paula and with Warriors Ranch, so Warriors Ranch first, tell me about Warriors Ranch involvement in this cornhole tournament, Miss Marla. Absolutely, so again, this is our first annual. We right. plan to do it again next year, probably yeah. um, not on Super Saturday next year, uh, just because we don't want to have to compete with the parade. Sure, yeah, that's um, tough, I imagine. Yeah, so we're probably gonna look at the Pig in the Park Friday before. Okay, yeah. We were very blessed for the turnout that we had here and are grateful to our community and have had a lot of people to come from all over, other states in fact, yeah. so quite surprised at that. No uh, didn't realize that cornhole was such a sport, <laughs> but it is. For sure. Yeah. yeah. And you mentioned competing with the parade, but you know, it, you are, but you, you still got a great turnout. That, that's pretty awesome, especially for your first one. That's right. For sure. Yeah. yeah. So let, let's talk about Warriors Ranch, okay? You know. 
Um, tell me about Warriors Ranch. Sure. So we started, Paula and I started Warriors Ranch February of 2020. And of course the following month is when COVID uh, blessed us. <laughs> and so that kind of put the brakes on some yeah. things. It's been a slow go, but we're again very blessed to um, be where we are today. We've had a lot of sponsors, a lot of community support to get us to where we are. and. Um, we're located here in Dublin, uh, about seven miles out of the, would you say seven miles? Yeah. Maybe five to seven miles out of the city limits off of uh, Walk Dairy Road. Gotcha. And it's about 19, a little over 19 acres. Wow, mm -hmm. awesome. And we do, Paul and I are both licensed professional counselors and uh, licensed clinical social workers, actually. And um, we provide uh, equine therapy and traditional therapies. Gotcha. Ms. Paula, tell me, tell me about what you do at Home Warriors Ranch. So I'm uh, the person who takes care of all the horses, but I'm also one of the therapists out there. And what we do out there is we work with individuals who have mental health issues, mental health needs. Um, we utilize the horses, as Marla loves to call them, our mind whispers in our therapy because they are mirrors of how people do, people feel. And um, people just seem to be connecting out there. One of our philosophies about therapy is that mental health doesn't happen in an office, so mental health recovery shouldn't happen in an office. So we take people outside, we'll do outside, sitting outside on the golf cart or just petting a horse or even just grooming a horse sometimes, that just helps too. So my role is just to kind of help coordinate some of that stuff and to be also one of the therapists as well. And one of the things that's key for uh, Warriors Ranch, our mission involves peer specialist, okay. uh, peer support, right. and that's that's crucial. You yes, know, while we're the clinical providers and we can uh, provide that level of care, that level of service, I think having peers involved, uh, particularly when you're talking about helping those who have served, um, it makes a tremendous difference. Right. That camaraderie, you just cannot put a price on it. And so we're very grateful to have uh, our board members are all veterans or family members of veterans. And they they give back by helping awesome. their fellow veterans yes, gotcha. in this process. So. Gotcha. Yeah, so, you know, Ms. Paula, you were talking about, uh, you know, you're doing everything outside a little bit differently. Talk about that and, you know, what was the inspiration to do therapy outside? We're going to do it a little bit different. Um, well, so I'm a researcher and some of the research is showing that we're having a little difficulty, especially after the pandemic, because everybody was inside. Right. And so a lot of, we're dealing with a lot of depression, a lot of anxiety, and people don't want to be sitting inside. They got to be moving. Right. And studies are showing that there's a real big connection between the mind and the body. So the more that we can keep moving and talking, the better off you know therapy happens. The, the, you get more of those aha moments, right. more of that connection on you know what's the core behind some of your anxiety and your depression. And there's something magical about Warriors Ranch where people, when you come out there, it's just so peaceful. Okay. It is so peaceful. So it just we kind of we almost look at it as almost this, this magical place where just peace happens and quiet. So. So you started it back in 2019, right? No, 2020. 20, 2020, okay, That's sorry, right. excuse me. So 2020, started early 2020, is that right? Yes. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so tell me, you know, how did it get started? What, what was the uh, inspiration, hey, we're gonna start Warriors Ranch? Well, uh, you know, again, we go back to when, you know, we were dealing with COVID and um, unfortunately, when COVID made its nasty presence, um, that changed our lives forever uh, in, a, in a lot of aspects. And for those that were involved in any kind of counseling services, what that meant was uh, we, we, had, we were forced to shift to telehealth. And, you know, veterans, uh, they don't really respond well to telehealth. They, they, they need that camaraderie. So kind of... It, having to think outside of the box right. to meet their need, meet them where they are and uh, mentally spiritually physically meet them where they are yeah. and so that's what really kind of put the the fire under us paul and i to come up with this idea and it has it has been a um it has been effective sure. and we're, we we're very passionate about it we will continue this mission and um just let God lead us. That's right. That's right. Yeah. That's powerful right there. And 
tell me about the growth you've seen since 2020 with Warriors Ring. Uh, it started out very slow, uh, just to be very transparent, very slow. Yeah. And um, in the last, uh, since the beginning of this year, we have uh, recently signed a contract with a local agency here to provide some child and adolescent therapy. Yes. And we have a couple of others that are interested in doing that. So again, very blessed that we have the support of our community and um, the word is getting around. That's We're right. getting phone calls from veterans, from family members of veterans needing help. Awesome. You know, in the community at large. In the community at large. Gotcha. So. Yeah, now if somebody wanted to support y'all, what, what would be the best way to do that? Uh, we have a website, Paula, help me out here, we, <laughs> warriorsranch.com. Gotcha. Right. And we're on Facebook, on Facebook. Warriors Ranch, um, and our, all of our contact information is there. It's uh, www.warriorsranch.com, and our phone number is... 478-353-1021. Gotcha, there mm -hmm. you go, there you go. So let's shift gears here, okay, let's talk about today's cornhole tournament. Okay. When did you get the idea, hey, let, let's do a cornhole tournament? Well, the person responsible for that is actually in there right now That's throwing right. bean bags. Yeah, there you um, go. She is, uh, her name is Amy Solon, and Paul and I, she has been such an asset to us. Amy joined our team. Uh, right now, actually, she's a student getting her, her master's. She's already got two masters. She's working on third, but uh, she, she already comes to us with therapy experience as a counselor. And... Uh, She's actually the one that is to blame <laughs> for this. Sure. Uh, she ca she came up with the idea, and we were kind of looking at each other like, "What is she talking about?" Um, but today, you know, has proven to me that you know, like there's bowling leagues, there are cornhole <laughs> leagues. And there are professional cornhole players. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So we had over 60 to sign up for this event okay, wow. today. So we anticipate next year being even bigger. That's right. That's right. That's a strong number, 60. And we're here at the Ice House. Let's talk about getting that venue. Uh, how did how that come about? Yes, we definitely want to um, give our thanks to Rich Mascaro and his beautiful wife, um, Judge Colby Mascaro, yep. for their um, generous um donation to allow us to use this building um, he's already offered it to us next year if there we choose to, awesome. to to do it just hadn't decided yet if we're going to do it on the friday night or the sure. super saturday and, he, and he's a great supporter supporter of warriors ranch yes, as well he's a veteran so. himself so so gotcha. we're great very appreciative of him yes ma'am no doubt and look miss uh miss marla miss paula they don't have y'all throwing bean bags out there today What's oh no that? we're just learning the game they would they would kick us out the door with, with the level of play oh, yeah. we've got going yeah. on for sure. We'd have to be in the learner section <laughs> for sure. Well, we might could do that next year, maybe a learner's league, there we go. a learner's there we part go. of the tournament. So what else do we have going on? I, I think I saw a silent auction over there, is that right? Yes, yes. we have a silent auction going on for the boards because there's several of the boards and um, we're auctioning those off. Plus, I think one official for the American Cornhole Association okay. silent auction for that board. We have some t-shirts up for sale. We have some hats. That's right. And in April, we're planning a trail ride. Okay. So there'll be more to come on that. Yeah. Uh, we're not going to do that this year? Not this year. Not this year. Okay. okay. Sorry about that. Scratch that. <laughs> Right. Uh, but uh, we will have some other events coming gotcha. up yeah. throughout the year. Yeah. And again, this event, Cornhole, is this is our first annual. There will be another one next year. That's right. And thereafter. And we're also going to be hosting a uh, the bike run. We're bringing the bike run back. Okay. Gotcha. So. Yeah. so look forward to that. And I'm sure the best way to keep up, maybe your Facebook. Is that yes. going to be yes. where to check? Yep. Warriors Ranch on Facebook. Hey, so glad to have you here in Dublin. Well, where's your location? And let's do your phone number one okay, more time. Okay, so 585 Vallambrosia Road here in Dublin. Uh, it's got a sign out front with a really long driveway, and Marla's got the phone number. It's 478-353-1021. There you go. Miss Marla, Miss Paula, thank you for talking with me. Thanks so much for what you're doing here in the community. Hey, thank you for bringing this cornhole tournament to Super Saturday. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Georgia Dermatology and Skin Cancer Center has been serving Georgia since 1996. Dr. Michael Sharkey, along with PA's Tony Lynn Herring, Rachel Westerbeck, Alan Manning, and Kelly Toller have helped patients with Mohs skin cancer surgery, routine skin exams, and general and surgical dermatology. So come see the professionals at Georgia Dermatology and Skin Cancer Center, located in Aaron Office Park in Dublin. Call for an appointment today at 275-7546. 
Looking for your pot of gold? Look no farther than Century 21 Durden Cordega Realty. When it comes to buying or selling your home, Century 21 is the number one realty company in Dublin and Lawrence County. Count on Brian Howell, Charlene Lamp, Adam White, David Deves, Jennifer Bradley, Mark Bateman, Jay Brantley, Jim Jarrett, Raina Dubberly, Yvonne Robertson, our broker George Durden and you'll find your pot of gold. Century 21 Durden Cornegay Realty. Log on to c21dublin.com. Stop by 1700 Veterans Boulevard or call us at 478-272-1535. Century 21 Durden Cornegay. Broker George Durden. Parts of this program brought to you by Clements and Keene Insurance. Clements and Keene Insurance, proud to be a part of the 58th Annual St. Patrick's Festival. Hey, I'm Heather Harrison. And I'm Kim Bracewell. And I've been a member of JV Fitness Center for 10 years. And I've been a member for over 20 years. Um, we love taking the strength training class here. The energy from the teachers is just fantastic. And also, I play racquetball and would love to have you come play racquetball with us. So come join us at Fairview Fitness Center. At Dublin Chevy GMC, we have shipments arriving daily. Whether it's Silverados, Yukons, or Tahoes, we have the ride for you. As a matter of fact, I'm doing everything I can to get the trucks ready for you. Whether it's a Blazer or a Terrain or any other crossover, we have the Chevy or GMC for you. And with rates as low as 2.99 on new Silverados, there's never a better time to buy. And remember, Don sells cars well only at Dublin Chevrolet. Allen's Heating and Cooling is your licensed Amana equipment dealer. Trust Allen's Heating and Cooling to install and service your heating and air conditioning unit. Allen services all brands, and with the purchase of a new unit, Amana offers a lifetime compressor warranty. Sean Clark or any of his friendly staff can help you today at Allen's Heating and Cooling. You're a Mana dealer. A Mana, last and last and last. Since 1965, our family has proudly provided physical, occupational, and speech therapy to Dublin, Lawrence County, and surrounding areas. Currently offering physical and occupational therapies, our mission is to work with patients and their families to reach an optimum level of independence. Whether post-sports injury, post-surgery, post-stroke, or just general wear and tear from everyday living, we strive to help you reach your goals and return to what you love doing. Remember, where you go for physical and occupational therapy is your choice. So, when your doctor prescribes it, choose Bass. Tradition is important here in Dublin and Lawrence County, and we have the tradition of the St. Patrick's Festival. So go out and support each vendor at the St. Patrick's Festival. Also, tradition is important here at A-plus Flooring and Construction. We provide quality people with quality service. Come shop with us. We have tile, LVP, carpet, vinyl, metal roofs, as well as vinyl siding. So come shop with us at 371 Georgia Highway 338 or give us a call at 478-676-2662. Look forward to doing business with you. There's a new place for senior care, a place with 24-hour valet service, and a boutique salon. A place with all-day arts and crafts. It even has a day spa. A place that's so much like home. Because, well, it is home. Home Instead Senior Care. When you need personalized care in the comfort of home. Hi, I'm Tom Domney, Dublin Wood Nelson Company. We're a full service wholesaler specializing in plumbing, irrigation, and industrial products. We are committed to building long-term relationships with our customers by earning your business every day. With a staff that collectively offers more than 50 years of expertise, our team knows your industry. We're able to answer your questions and are ready to help you get the parts and equipment you need. At Dublin Wood Nelson, our goal is long-term success of your business. We achieved that goal with a simple commitment, doing things right one customer at a time. Our showroom is complete with the latest styles and fixtures. Stop by and see us at 507 Airport Road or give us a call at 478-272-3585 at Dublin Wood Nelson. 
Hey, I got bad reception, but the boys did such a great job letting our friends know about the chip shortage and ordering their vehicles. Now I just need the vehicles to come in. I don't want to end up with pie in my face. I want pie in my face. If you like Lost them. Call, wow, look at all the new vehicles. Ordering works after all. You got pie now. Others call you customers. We call you friends. That's Dublin Ford Lincoln. Quality products and installation since 1985. That's Four Seasons. Farmers State Bank has been serving Lawrence County for over 100 years. Farmers State Bank knows the community and the people that live here with us. And we're here to help with all your banking needs. Whether it's personal or business account, mortgage or loans, we do it all with our knowledgeable and friendly staff. Dedication trust, commitment, teamwork. That's banking at Farmer State Bank. So call or come by and see us today and see why banking is as easy as FSB. Farmer State Bank with locations in Dublin and Cadwell. Member FDIC and an equal housing lender. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we had to grab one of our professionals. Negative. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Albert right here, but AB, as he's known, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. And so you see his shirt, CSRA. T tell him about that. Well, it's the Central Savannah River area. That's the Augusta, North Augusta, Aiken area, uh, right off of the Savannah River. And we have a group of about, I don't know, 30 people or so. Gotcha. They get together. We play three, four times a week. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, Mondays, Tuesdays, Friday nights. And Thursdays, yep. okay. and occasionally in a tournament thrown in somewhere else. Sure, but, I got uh, you. So tell me about that. I mean, that sounds pretty intense right there, Mr. Albert. Tell me about that group. It, can it get intense? Tell me about it. Occasionally, <laughs> but all in all, I mean, everybody's uh, just kind of a tight-knit group. Awesome. Uh, we enjoy each other's company. There's usually food involved. Yeah, that's nice. A little bit of alcohol occasionally. Maybe. Probably. Yeah. Probably. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. Okay. But uh, all in all, it's, it's just a gathering to get together. Most of them work. Uh, the wife and I are retired, so so nice. we can hit all the events. Right. Sure. Uh, but it's the camaraderie, just being together, yeah. enjoying something that all of us like to do. Yeah. A sport that uh, can be played from any age. We've, That's right. We've had children throw with us. Uh, and I think me and the wife are maybe the seniors in the group. Sure. Uh, but you'll, you'll show them how it's done every once in a while. Yeah, every now and then the old folks show that's them right. up a little yeah, bit. You know. right. But anyway, it, it's all about having fun, man, awesome. and the camaraderie. Yeah, yeah that's they are so important. And tell me, you know, when did you and your wife sort of join in on CSR? Well, actually, we've thrown bags in the backyard for quite a few years. Yeah. And a friend of mine posted something on Facebook. And I asked him where, you know, I just went went back and asked him where they were playing sure. at and he said his house so he's got a big game room plus yeah. the garage we play in and uh so we've been involved with the group now for probably six eight months okay I'll gotcha. uh, and uh there's some good throwers in the group we've got people that that come down from the columbia area lexington uh all the way from greenwood south carolina yes, sir. Uh, we've even had some of the uh college Winners, sure. uh, two guys, Avery Snaps and Angel, and I can't remember okay. Angel, but they gotcha. actually won the doubles, collegiate doubles in uh, Myrtle Beach okay. this past awesome. year. There so. you go, yeah. yeah. So yeah. there's there's some good throws. Yeah, there. there you go yeah. for sure. So tell me, how did you know? There's several of you walking around with the CSRA shirts on today. How did you hear about this tournament? 
I'm actually, I think Jason, well, he's one of our military guys. Okay, yes, sir. We have one event there at the uh, National Guard Army there in Augusta. And I think he heard about it through the organization that's putting awesome. this one on. Yeah. Uh, Warriors Ranch. The ranch, Warriors. yes. Yep, yep, yep. So anyway, that's how we kind of found out about it. Okay. And, and so they was about, I don't know, a group of maybe, I think we've got six or eight teams in it, came down, spent a night last night. Awesome. Enjoying Dublin a little bit That's yesterday right. before the tournament. So. That's right. Yeah. Anyway. Now, how, how's Dublin been to you? How's Good. It been for you? Good. Yeah. Uh, beautiful downtown area. Me and the wife got here early. Like sure. I said, we're retired, so That's right. we got down early. Just walked the streets yesterday and. Uh, we have had a really good time so far. Awesome. We've enjoyed being yes, here. Yes, sir. Hey, we're glad to have you here. Well, now, thank you. Mr. Albert, yes. this tournament today, who are you teaming up with? And, and how's it going so Well, far? the wife and I team up. That's right. Sure. And uh, unfortunately, we just got put out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but hopefully one of our groups will be in here at the I end. So maybe it. score, hopefully. Yeah, and look, you, you talk about that camaraderie. Look, you're already out now, but I'm sure you're going to have a great time the rest of the way still. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I think they're going to do another little tournament after okay. the main event the here. Sure. And uh, we'll probably find a place to eat supper here in town later on. There you go, man. Yeah, Mr. Albert, th thank you for being here, man. Thank you for talking with me. More importantly, thank All you, Mr. Right. Albert. Thank you. Yes, sir. Pleasure. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are at the Cornhole Tournament still. We've got Mr. Thaddeus Rollins with us. And, Mr. Thaddeus, what, what brings you out today to the Cornhole Tournament? Uh, okay, yes, I was invited out to the Cornhole Tournament. Uh, I am uh, the Executive Director of Veteran Support Services. And uh, what we do, we uh, we got a new program that's called Getting Active, and one of our uh, Services is to provide veterans with a, a, an active participation in physical activity as far as cornhole. Gotcha. And uh, cornhole is a very good uh, means of veterans relieving some of their stress. And uh, I also work with veterans that's on uh, substance uses, that have substance use disorder. And so we use cornhole as a means for, you know, sustaining recovery. Gotcha. So how important is physical activity for these veterans? Oh, yeah, it's very important. Uh, we know that physical activity sustain, help maintain recovery and improve mental health. And uh, this, it's really not just for veterans, physical activity is for all, you know, all people. And so we use veterans and, and physical activity as a means of basically just coping with their stress and everyday stress and to help uh, with their recovery process. Gotcha. So veteran support services, how, how did that get started? Tell me about that. Okay, yeah, I'm a person in uh, long-term recovery. What that means is that I haven't used alcohol and drugs for more than 21 years. Yes, sir. And, well, actually 27. Uh, I, I'm go. also a veteran. And so I stayed in the Navy. I retired in the Navy after 21 years. Okay. And so I know that a lot of veterans uh, actually, you know, deal with mental health issues and post-traumatic stress disorder. And, uh, you know, so I just basically combined those two together, my recovery uh, and also my time as a, as a veteran. Yes, sir. And we came together. And I know a lot of veterans uh, also struggle with trying to get their uh, disability benefits. So that's one of the services that we offer is also uh, VA disability benefits help. And so we put those, uh, all those things together and combined them together and came up with Veteran Support Services. Gotcha. That's awesome. So let's, let's talk about Cornhole, Mr. Thaddeus. So are you, you playing in this tournament? Any? Yeah, I play. I'm just actually, uh, I'm working with the um, American Cornhole Association, who's re actually sponsoring it, actually helping put it together. Yes, sir. And so uh, I'm actually a Cornhole ambassador okay. through the uh, American Cornhole Association. So he actually asked me to come out. And he knew that uh, I also had a nonprofit, and uh, also, you know, the Warriors Ranch is also a nonprofit that helped veterans. So he basically asked me to come out and try to, you know, help him with some of the uh, things that we need to do when we play cornhole. And I also play, and yeah, so I go. enjoy playing cornhole. I love it. It's, uh, I play it about three or four times a week. And I just started playing uh, back in July, and I've gotten pretty good at it. So, yeah, y'all you go. yeah, look out for Mr. Thaddeus. So, yep. so that the ACA is that right? The American Cornhole American Association. American Cornhole Association. Okay, how'd you get in with them, and now oh, you're an ambassador? Yeah. So what happened is I was looking at, like I said, we were starting a, a get active program. So I was looking at a, another way to help veterans, and so I actually just Google, you know, yeah, Google awesome. association. Uh, as far as uh, Cornhole Association and the American Cornhole Association came up and so I started looking into it and reading and doing some research and then talking with Ryan and we uh, had an interview over the phone and uh, he asked me you know to submit an application there is an application that you uh, submit for gotcha. the uh, a a Cornhole Ambassador and so I submitted the application and uh, 
It's a good fit. Yeah, no doubt. So, Mr. Thaddeus, where are you from? You, you're not from around Dublin, are you? No, I'm, I currently live in Douglasville, but I'm actually, I was born and raised in Virginia. Okay, uh, in wow. a small town called Capron, Virginia, Southampton County, uh, about an hour from Norfolk, Virginia. I uh, grew up on a farm, and uh, I grew up on a farm, and I left the farm when I went into the Navy at 18 years yes, old. Sir. And uh, so, I actually, you know, was born and raised in in. Cape of Virginia. Okay, gotcha. So, how, how many days you been in Dublin? Is this your first day? Uh, this is just actually my first day. Oh, good. Very first day. Gotcha. And uh, Dublin is an outstanding place. It's, it reminds me of being in uh, at home. Yeah. You know, in Cape It's uh, you know, I live in a small town, and everybody's friendly, and uh, we just, you know, I just met some some good people here, and it reminds me, like I said, of, of me growing up, you know, in in, in the in the country. That's and right. there's a lot of farmland, a lot of country where I can relate to. You know, I grew up in that area. Yes, sir. Well, Mr. Thaddeus, I tell you what, we, we're happy to bring you in just for one day. And yep. We'll take you for some more. Man. Yeah. Look forward to having you back. And thank you for the, the awesome things you're doing with, yep. you know, Veteran Sports Services. Actually, and, yeah. You know, a cornhole ambassador. Yeah. And we thank you for being here, Mr. Thaddeus. Yep. Thank you, man. Uh, yep, I appreciate the uh, spending time with me. Yes, sir. Appreciate okay. it. Okay, thank you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's going on right here. i got to get out of the way because I'm in the way of these boards. But it's going on behind me, in front of me. Cornhole tournament here at the Ice House big part of Super Saturday. Talk to some great people here. Thank y'all for tuning in. Thank you for tuning in to all of our Super Saturday coverage right here on TV 35. It's planting season at Roach Farm and Garden. Plant your fruit trees now. Roach Farm and Garden has fruit trees as low as $32.99. Blueberry bushes, winter veggies, even have some seed potatoes left. Don't wait for them weeds to come up. Spray now for them summer weeds. Soil test, soil test, soil test. Bring your results by and we will get you exactly what you need. From lime to fertilizer and all the weed prevention, Roach Farm and Garden can carry it all. If you priced eggs lately, Roach Farm and Garden has brooders, pens, waters, and feeders. Roach Farm and Garden has rabbits, chicks coming soon. Go ahead and stock up on feed. At Roach Farm and Garden, we have feed for just about everything. Is hunting season really ever over? The answer is no. Roach Farm and Garden has boss bug feeders, a huge selection of deer feed, salt blocks, and trophy rock. Remember, do it right, do it smart. Roach Farm and Garden, two locations, Dublin and Wrightsville. Companion Care. The independence of those you love, it's important. Companion Care Senior Services helps those important to you maintain independence longer. Caring for those you love. Personal, professional care, all from the comfort of home. With care plans available from 4 to 24 hours a day, we can meet your needs. Find out how. Local, loving, in-home care. For your loved ones, call us today. You've been saying you want it, and now's the time to get it. Pool and patio furniture, in style, with fabrics you want, comfort and durability you deserve. You'll even save on accessories and add your own personal style. Come see the full line of pool and patio furniture at Mid-State Pools and Spas today and bring home a colorful poolside. Now's a great time to save at Mid-State Pools and Spas, located on Veterans Boulevard in Dublin. Mid-State Pools and Spas, we know pools. Hey, I'm TJ Shuler with Myers Equipment Supply. Come see us for all your sales and service needs. We do lawn and garden. We sell Gravely lawnmowers. We sell Echo handheld equipment. Pretty much a one-stop shop for your lawn care needs. We also do Can-Am ATVs and side-by-sides, and we got plenty of them. We service all the brands that we sell, of course, and we actually are now starting to service other brands that we don't sell. We are located at 301 North Jefferson Street, and our hours of operation are Monday through Friday from 8 to 5.30, and then Saturdays from 9 to 12. Since 1916, Gravely has been designed, engineered, and made right here in the USA. Whether you prefer gas or electric, every Gravely has been forged with the commercial landscaper in mind. So they're not only built to last, but to also keep you riding comfortably from dawn to dusk. So ask yourself, are you ready to graduate to a Gravely? Hey, I'm TJ Shuler with Myers Equipment Supply. Come see us for all your sales and service needs.
Throughout the years, the Stanley family has served our community in times of need. The Stanley family has always been committed to providing personalized, professional, and compassionate services to help lighten the burdensome times in our lives. We've always been able to count on the Stanley family for support throughout the difficult times that follow the loss of a loved one. Through planning and or pre-planning considerations, arrangements are always as unique as our individual loved ones. Stanley Funeral Home and Crematory, 1320 North Jefferson, Dublin. Or log on to stanleyfuneralhome.com. And remember, you can always count on the Stanley family. Townsend Brothers Funeral Home is proud to sponsor these St. Patrick's events and reminds you to get out and enjoy the St. Patrick's Festival here in Dublin and Lawrence County. Townsend Brothers Funeral Home, a proud sponsor of the St. Patrick's Festival, serving our community since 1937. Welcome to MedPlus Immediate Care in Dublin. Our urgent care walk-in medical clinic is located at 1006 Hillcrest Parkway in Dublin. Southeastern Immediate Care is now MedPlus. We're excited to add Southeastern Clinic to our brand of urgent cares. We strive for a five-star experience for every patient encounter. Our goal is to provide the very best in class urgent care at MedStop Clinic experience from the moment you walk in our front door. Looking to be seen today? Our providers are available seven days a week to help you feel better. At our urgent care, no appointments are necessary. We offer a simple online check-in process to get you seen quicker. We look forward to seeing you in person at MedPlus Immediate Care in Dublin, 1006 Hillcrest Parkway. Call 478-272-8140, 478-272-8140.